And as for the Pope, I refuse him as Christ's enemy and Antichrist with all his false doctrine. As they may burn, but our cause, religion and doctrine they will never vanquish. Just outside the London Wall, on the eastern bank of the River Fleet, lies the smooth field. In the 1500s, during the reign of Henry VIII to Mary I, hundreds of heretics were burnt at the stake, at least 65 in Smithfield. I will pay my vows to thee, O Smithfield, Smithfield, hell doth receive them, where the wretches burn forever. All oh, you papists, behold, you wish for a miracle, and here now you see a miracle, for in the fire I feel no pain. The City Corporation has approved the building of a substantial stage in Smithfield, for the King's councillors, Lord Mayor and Alderman, to sit at the execution of the condemned heretics, whom shall be burned at the cost of this city. I find in the registers of London the names of divers men and women, troubled, persecuted and imprisoned by the proud, cruel and bloody rage of the Catholic seat. William Sawtree, Joan Borton, John Tewkesbury, James Bainham, John Frith, Andrew Hewitt, Friar Forrest, John Nicholson, Robert Barnes, William Jerome, John Bradford, John Philpot, Thomas Whittle, Bartlett Green, Joan Boucher, Thomas Brown, Isabel Forster, Joan Ward. There is one God, one faith, one spiritual authority. There is one universal church of the faithful, outside of which there is absolutely no salvation. Transubstantiation, a doctrine by which the bread and wine offered as a sacrament in the Eucharist becomes the actual blood and body of Christ, was infallibly defined. To deny this was heresy. Heretico Corumbendo, 1401, that this wicked sect, preachings, doctrines and opinions should henceforth cease and be utterly destroyed. Faith is that weapon strong, 
which will not fail at need. My foes, therefore, among bear with me, I proceed. For as much as my hand hath offended, writing contrary to my heart, therefore my hand shall first be punished. For when I come to the fire, it shall be burned first. And now, forsooth, you will burn me for a piece of flesh. In the shadow of thy wings I will trust, O God, until iniquity pass away.